Hi guys, it's Nikki, Creative Nikki's Homemade Craft. Today we'd like to teach you how to make the treble crochet. You need a ready-to-go chain and your hook. And that's all you need in order to learn how to do the treble crochet, how to increase the treble crochet, as well as decrease. So let me teach you how to do that. You're going to skip three chains, one, two, three, and going into the fourth. Some people go into the fifth. When they do that, they count the first four as a treble crochet. I prefer not doing that. So for us, we're going to go and skip three, one, two, three, and going into the fourth one to do a treble crochet. First, you're going to yarn over twice. It looks like you're going to have three loops on your hook. Hold them and go into the fourth chain from the hook. You now have four loops on your hook. Yarn over, go through two. Now you have three. Yarn over, go through two. Now you have two. Yarn over and go through two. You now see kind of these twisting areas. You see three parts of it. That's how you can identify a treble crochet. Let's do that again. Yarn over twice hold the yarn, go through your stitch, pull through your loop, you have four on your hook, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. So you do that three times. You yarn over twice, go into the next, yarn over, pull through two, you have four loops, yarn over, pull through two, Yarn over, pull through two. Yarn over, pull through two. Let's do that a few more times. Let's do one more time. Okay, so this is now how a five treble crochet looks like. You can see they're pretty tall. There are pretty big gaps in between, but that's how a treble crochet looks like. Let's do a treble crochet increase. Yarn over twice, go into stitch, yarn over, pull through, just like a normal treble crochet. Yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. Looks like a normal treble crochet. But we're going to do another one into the same chain. Now you have you have two treble crochets in the same chain creating two stitches. So you're increasing from one to two. Let's do that one more time. So we're making two treble crochets in the same stitch and therefore increasing from one to two. As you can see right here, two treble crochets in the same stitch, creating now two stitches right here from one. Now let me teach you how to decrease a treble crochet. It starts out the same way, but you won't finish the stitch. So check this out. You have four loops on your hook, yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over, pull through two. On the last two, you're going to stop. You are now doing the same thing again in the next stitch. Yarn over, pull through two. You currently have five on your hook. Yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over, pull through two. Now you have two unfinished treble crochets and three loops on your hook. Yarn over and pull through all three. You now decreased from two to one. You have one stitch right here but you started out with two. So let's do that one more time. Going into the stitch, yarn over, pull through two, two times, then stopping and doing the same thing again into the next stitch. Yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, two unfinished treble crochets, three loops. Yarn over and pull through all three. 
you now decreased from two treble crochets to one. So in this video, you learned how to do treble crochets, how to increase treble crochets, and how to decrease treble crochets. I hope this video was helpful. Please like, comment, and share, and be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to learn all the other basic, more advanced stitches as well as new patterns. All my patterns are free. Thanks for watching. Bye.